to our channel. I'm Robert. And I'm Kaylin. How are you doing today? Um, I'm a little hoarse. Oh no. So if I sound weird to you guys, I'm not sick really. I just, my throat. Guys, did you hear what happened? Did you hear what happened? Yeah. <gasps> I can't believe it. Honestly, we are so excited for everyone. If you haven't heard what happened with Ellie and Jared and their IVF grant giveaway, every finalist is getting IVF. So every finalist is gonna get IVF, which is absolutely fantastic. So on our last video that we did, where we talked about all the finalists, John and Joan are some of the finalists and they left a comment on our video and we've kind of been talking back and forth. It's kind of like having a social media pen pal. <laughs> we've gotten to know her and John a little bit better and we've gotten to know a little bit of the other finalists a little bit better too. Like such as Stuart and Catherine, they started a YouTube channel and they're going around helping people. The other day I watched them, they paid for someone's food in the fast food line behind them and it was kind of funny, they were waiting at the gas station to pay for someone's gas, and they said that like 20 minutes went by and they sat there and no one came up for gas. We'll link that channel below so you can go check out Stuart and Catherine. This is a huge blessing to all of them and it's really, it's really a huge blessing to the whole infertility community because even though there's a lot of people who didn't win, it still gets the word out there and gets social media buzzing about infertility. But John and John, we've really gotten to know them a little bit better than everyone else. And last video, we said we're not telling you who to vote for, but after getting to know them, we would tell you who to vote for. That, I mean, they are really, really deserving, which we're just so excited that everyone's getting IVF, which is fantastic. We were thinking about it and we were like, these people, they're not used to being in the public eye. And so something like this, where they're almost becoming like mini celebrities, all these couples, because I mean, Ellie and Jared have over a million subscribers. So now over a million people, and that's not, subscribers isn't how many people watch. Like I'm sure many more people watch. They all now know who, th who these people are and now they're like invested in their life. Like they wanna know what's gonna happen. It can be scary, I'm sure, for people who they might live very private lives and now they're being thrown into social media. And we have a little bit of experience with this, but not, not nearly as much as they're going to get. When we started our YouTube channel, we started it because of our infertility journey. We filmed our pregnancy test results and we put it out there for everyone to see. And it was, it was hard. We went through three IUIs and everyone else also were expecting for us to get pregnant. And it was not only disappointing to us, but also disappointing to everyone else. And we felt like a lot of times not posting videos or just kind of hiding away because the pregnancy didn't work time after time after time. And it's, you know, it's scary because you're thinking, oh, all these people are invested in you. They want to see a good result. And maybe there's not a good result. Not only that, but you'd be surprised some of the mean comments that you get from people when you're just, when you're sharing something so intimate, something like really personal. So we just want to start the conversation and get people thinking what it could be like to be one of these couples and to really just spread the word of being positive and being a support. Yeah. Um, that's stressful. It's so stressful. Everyone is watching and it is expecting you to become pregnant. Yeah. That is... Like over a million people have their eyes on you waiting for you to be pregnant. How scary is that? Mm -hmm. Right? Think about that for a second. That's really scary. That's really intimidating. It's a lot of pressure. It's a lot of pressure. So if you are a finalist and you're watching this, don't think that, mm -hmm. you know, because stress can, stress can do so much to a body. Mm -hmm. And I think that's one reason why we stopped after the third IUI is because I was literally stressed out to the point to where I was getting physically sick and I needed a break. So we encourage everyone to be positive and we encourage everyone to send well wishes and not necessarily put 
pressure on these finalists because stress can really determine what your body does. And so they need to be as stress-free as possible. Yeah. For anyone who did not become a finalist and you are struggling with infertility, we do want to plug Fairhaven Health. That's someone who we've been blessed enough to have them sponsor us and they have given us free supplements. We've been taking those for the last month month and a half now yeah they are natural supplements that just kind of help with everything that goes along with fertility so um for me it helps me with my ovarian function and just helps the eggs and the egg quality um and help getting me regular and for him it helps his swimmers the count and um it helps the quickness of them. And I feel a huge difference too. Like I feel more energy. I feel I sleep better at night. Like I can tell a big difference. So those are all natural supplements. We'll link those below also. And if you want to check that out, they're really affordable and they're really great people to work with. They also, for people who may be going through IVF, they have a special formula just for that. So go on the website and you can talk to your doctor about it, whether or not it's a good um, fit for you, but they do have that as well. So guys, congratulations to all the finalists out there. Congratulations to John and Joan. We really like you guys a lot and we're super happy you won. Honestly, can we be a little biased? I think we can be a little bit biased, but we're glad everyone won, everyone. Honestly, we are so excited for you guys and we're so excited for the conversation that this starts for the social media buzz about infertility because I feel like infertility is something that's forgotten about sometimes. And so we really appreciate this from Ellie and Jared and we're just really thankful for them. So thank you to Ellie and Jared for this. Thank you to all the finalists for getting your videos out there and winning an IVF, you guys. Oh, I'm so excited for you. It's ridiculous how excited I am for you. A lot of people have been asking us recently if we have a GoFundMe, and we do. The Hickmans set up a GoFundMe for us quite a while ago. So if you do want to give to that, if you are in a giving mood, we don't really like asking for money. We actually despise asking for money. That's why we don't really talk about it a lot. But if you do want to give to IVF, There's it's chance. below. <laughs> There's your chance. We would really appreciate it if you did. Everyone who didn't win, stay positive. Good things are coming. To everyone who did win, congratulations. Thank you to Ellie and Jarrett. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And leave a happy, friendly comment below. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. 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 Bye.